here we are with the senior captain and 133 pounder for your St. Cloud State University wrestling team, Andy Picorni. Andy, 47 straight duels the Huskies have won dating back to January 27th of 2011. You being one of the seniors on this team, how, how can you tell me how this has helped you as a uh, wrestler and just as, as a team with this streak going? Uh, well, it's been great uh, being on this team with this uh, streak. I know we don't talk about it very much uh, in the room just because uh, the more we talk about something like that, you know, uh, baseball rules, you don't want to talk about a streak while it's still going. So, uh, but uh, when it comes to winning and being consistent like that, uh, I don't think any team has been uh, as consistent as we've been over the stretch that we have ever. So uh, just the fact that we have guys filling in when guys are injured, you know, uh, we're, we're deep at every weight. Uh, just guys going hard in the wrestling room, pushing everybody. Um, that depth has really pushed us to be able to win every single duel over the past uh, several years. And I know myself uh, talked to earlier about uh, wanting to have on my banner after the season, saying that I never lost a duel, and that's still a possibility. So uh, if we go through the season without losing, then I'll get a, we'll put that up there. So having that streak has been uh, something to fall back on, knowing that we've uh, never lost as a team. You know, individuals might you know be injured or, or have a bad day or anything like that. But as a team, we've been solid every single time going out. Speaking of injuries, you've had a couple yourself. The NCAA has granted you a full year of eligibility with your uh, medical hardship. Tell us a little bit about how you feel as an individual, knowing that hey, the NCAA has given me a second chance here, one last year to give it all I got. I feel grateful. Um, for a while, we didn't know if we were going to get it or. Uh, if we had enough, you know, PhD saying I could or, or anything like that, uh, but you know, the NCAA it made it difficult uh, for a process to go through. But I understand why it's difficult because you don't just want anybody going through getting an extra year for no good reason. So we uh, worked hard, got the year back, and uh, hope to capitalize and get a national title this year. We had a lot of good kids coming in this room around 125 to 133, even 141. Tell us a little bit about how you stepped in as captain in that leadership role with these new kids coming in. Uh, well, uh, with our main coaches that are here being more bigger guys, coaches kind of asked me to take an active role as a captain um, and as a little guy to help the uh, guys at 25 and 33 and 41 and you know, 49, a couple of guys too, just help out staying late and practices, showing technique, you know, mentally getting guys through the week. So uh, it's been uh, a bit of a grind as far as going through the things I need to do and also trying to help other guys out at the same time. But as far as being a captain, uh, you can't be selfish with your time. you got to go out and help other people. St. John's, Stearns County Showdown. What is the game plan uh, Thursday against the Johnnies? Go out, fire on all cylinders. Come off the whistle strong and uh, show what they're in dominate every match. Your 133 pounder and senior captain for your St. Cloud State University wrestling team, Andy Picorni. Thanks, Andy, and best of luck.